Hello friends, welcome to CAD Mania. Today we will learn about two-stroke engine, in the end of the video I will tell you, important thing about two-stroke engine, so watch the video till last. Please subscribe the channel and like the video also press the bell icon to get the update of our new video. Now let's begin the topic. The two-stroke engine requires only two piston movements, in order to generate power. First one is when the piston move towards top dead center. This is called upward movement of piston. And second one is when the piston move towards bottom dead center, this called downward movement of piston. The engine is able to produce power after one cycle because the exhaust and intake of the gas occurs simultaneously. Overall, a two-stroke engine contains two processes. First one is compression stroke. In this stroke, the inlet port opens, and air-fuel mixture enters the chamber and the piston moves upward compressing this mixture. A spark plug ignites the compressed fuel and begins the power stroke. Second one is power stroke. In power stroke the heated gas exerts high pressure on the piston, the piston moves downward, waste heat is exhausted. Compared to four-stroke engines, two strokes are lighter, more efficient, have the ability to use lower grade fuel, more cost efficient. Therefore, the lighter engines results in a higher power to weight ratio, more power for less weight. Now, important thing about two-stroke engine. Do you know who had discovered the first two-stroke engine? The first commercial two-stroke engine was patented in 1881 by Scottish engineer Dougald Clerk. But, the first truly practical two-stroke engine is attributed to Yorkshireman Alfred Angus Scott, who started producing twin-cylinder water-cooled motorcycles in 1908. Thanks for watching, please subscribe the channel.